Regardless if you use NT8 for demo trading or live trading, you must know how to do this. Okay, I get this question a lot about how to add stops to existing positions. So when you're already in the market and you want to add a stop to it, how do you do that? So let's go over that today. So it might not be the most obvious way of doing it, but it certainly does the job and it has to be something that you know. first thing I'm going to do is place an order to short the market. Order filled. Right now I'm in the market, but there's no stop attached to this trade. I have a few options, one of which is I can right click on the chart and I can put in a sell order to act as a order stop filled. and then toss in another buy order as a target. But these orders are not attached to order each other. Filled. That means that if I close this position, order the targets and the stops are going to remain. Just like if I left this open and a stop gets hit, the target position is going to remain open. The next thing you know is I'll be in a long position. Now what I want to have happen is I want to attach stops and targets to this existing trade. So how do I do that? So you're in the market short again. Open up your control center and go to your positions tab. So find the position that you're in and you're going to right click and go to apply ATM strategies. Now I have a few of them here, but I'll put a link in the description of the video if you want to download some free ATM templates that we've created, so be sure to grab those. But I'm going to select this one that puts in three targets with a 1% stop and a 2% target system. And hey, if you think that's pretty cool and helpful, go ahead and whack that thumbs up button so that we know it's helped. Once I apply the ATM template, you'll see that the orders will be automatically inserted. I'm going to go and close this position and you will see that all the orders that have been attached to the position will also be removed, unlike order what happened canceled. before. This is because the ATM order is attached to that existing position. So that's really it. I mean, that's all there is to it. You need to attach your ATM template to your existing position that's listed in the control center. Now, if you want to know all the latest and greatest news surrounding NT8 releases, what features or bugs or fix, or if you want to find some good tutorials surrounding NT8, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for our upcoming videos. I'm going to leave you with two free indicators that you can download. One is a priceline tool that draws uh, basically the, a, a horizontal line at current price and the other is a news tool that will show you upcoming and past news events for the week. So both are very useful and totally free. I'll see you subscribers in the next video.